So everyone, this is a video to show one way to record yourself reading a read aloud for a mystery reader activity if you um, are unsure of how to get started. So here I have set up my workspace. You can see that I'm going to sit with my face facing a window so that the book and my, well, not my face because my face isn't going to be in it. But the book will be illuminated um, and it's well lit. That's important. Um, if the light is behind you, then you're not going to be able to see the book very well. It'll be in the shadow. Also, I have set my phone on my computer. I did that so that I can hold the book and not have to hold the phone. It just like seems to work for me when I am trying to video with no hands. Uh, there's a lot of ways to do that. This is one option. You can see my highly sophisticated uh, computer elevator is a plastic tote. So um, I'm going to try to set up the shot so that I'm holding just the book and not showing my face. It's okay if it shows your face or something like that. We can edit all of that out. So don't worry about like taking time to center the page. Um, just wait until your page is centered the way that you want it before you actually say anything because the audio and the video go together. All right, so here's how I'm gonna get started. So I'm gonna center my book so that I can see the book, but not my face. So I need to like lean out of it as much as possible and really take time after every page turn to readjust before speaking again. And it's hard, it's going to be hard to show the book and read the book without getting my face in there. So just be aware that we can edit in between every single shot if needed. Taking my time to center the pages and then speaking loudly and clearly after that's done. Etc. Etc. I'm going to show you one more way that you can do this if um, a hands-free facing you um, camera is not an option. Your other option is to take a picture of each page and then record a voice memo or even a video um, of yourself reading it and I will put them together and and just like add a page turn effect to a slideshow and I will make it look like you're reading it. So in that case you just want to have your book really center it get your pictures of each one, you know, title, and really make sure it's nice and flat. And it's okay if your finger's in the picture, if it's helping it stay flatter. I mean, it looks like you're holding it, which will be a clue. And it's totally fine to have some of them landscape and some of them portrait. Um, just make sure you get every single one, send them to me along with the recording of your voice, and I'll put them together. Uh, please make sure that you send me files, not YouTube videos, and that I have permissions to access them. Thank you. Bye.